Also, I'd just like to point out that I'm actually using a waffle as a camera stand. And I personally, personally think that's a new level. And I deserve a thumbs up for that, at least. First of all, cheers. It is a Monday night and I all of a sudden feel like I want to make some puppy chow because I've never made it before. I actually saw Colleen eating this. I saw Brooklyn and Bailey making this. Every time I watched someone eating it, I was like, I really want to try this damn thing. I'm currently in Bulgaria and they don't have the right cereal, but that's all right. We're gonna improvise today. And I know this is so not it and I'm embarrassed to even be like showing this to you. Also, I just want to deeply, sincerely apologize for this awful lighting and setting. But this is this is what we're gonna do. It's nighttime. I don't have any lights, and I wanted to make some damn poppy chow. Or what is it, muddy muddy pet up and pedal? First of all, what you're gonna want to do is pour yourself a nice large glass of wine because ain't nothing better than having some wine whilst making something. Take a big old swoosh, swoosh, swink. Right, first you're gonna wanna get your. That made no sense. Sounds like I'm already drunk, but I'm not. It's like I literally have two sips. First, you're gonna wanna grab your cereal. So I'm using this one. It's so the wrong one. This is not what we should be using. You're supposed to use like Chex wheat and Chex rice, but ain't nobody got that in Europe. Actually, maybe they have it in Europe, but not in Bulgaria. You're gonna wanna grab a large bowl, so I'm just gonna use this wooden one. It's like a massive whack bowl. Amazing. I think another swig. So first you want to put some spinach, and no, I'm kidding. Today, I was in the shop, and let me tell you, it's really hard to find spinach in Bulgaria for some reason. I was in the shop though, and I found some spinach, and I was so freaking happy. And I looked at my mom, and I said to my mom, isn't it funny what makes me happy when I'm 22, and what makes me happy when I'm a kid? It's so different, isn't it? Right, so you're gonna wanna open your damn cereal box, and I think we're gonna use all of it. What have I done here? Also, excuse this accent, I don't know what it is. It just kinda comes out of me. You know? I mean, this cereal is so not the right one at all, but we're gonna make this work. So pour the cereal in, and then just wait while I'm at it. Quick fact, this used to be my favorite cereal ever as a kid. I ate it every morning. I loved when it got like soft from the milk, and then the chocolate would just like melt in your mouth. I stopped eating it when I realized how fucking awful it is for you though. Like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And that was like a year ago, by the way, so I'm, I'm Mentality is not great. Next, you're gonna wanna take some chocolate and I'm actually just gonna use this one because like I'm trying to be healthy here. So I was like, I'm gonna go into the bio section and get something a little less that's gonna fucking kill me. Also, I'm not using measurements here. I'm also not looking at measurements because like ain't nobody got time for that. I'm just gonna kind of guess. I know which ingredients, so that's good enough. So since chocolate chips apparently don't exist in Bulgaria either, we're gonna try and break this into small pieces to melt. We also don't have a microwave, so. Let go. Grab your chocolate, use chocolate chips, don't be an asshole. And you're gonna wanna start popping them in. Doing your thing, popping them in. I have a feeling this is not enough chocolate, but my mom's like, it's gonna be enough, even though she's never made puppy chow in her life, so I don't know why she felt like she knew what she was talking about. You're gonna wanna put like a whole tub of butter. You're gonna wanna get that nice lump of butter in there, and then you realize that it's definitely not enough chocolate, and you have a bit of a panic attack because your mother told you that it was enough. And then you question your whole like childhood, and you question your mother, and you say to yourself, was my mother mother always right because she always told me things and I believed her but now she told me this was gonna be enough chocolate and we definitely need a two packs. Mother, 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 mother. And this is gonna be the worst thing I've ever done. So I'm gonna add a little bit of Milka bubble chocolate. I don't know if this will go well but the more chocolate the better. And take a swig while you're at it. Mm. And then you wanna grab your vanilla aroma. You will just dump one in just like that. This is melting real nice. You want to grab your peanut butter and you want to grab a spoon. This is the best part. Oh yeah. And you're going to get really in there. You're going to want to get like a good old chunk of peanut butter. Please remember that I've never done this, nor do I know what I'm doing. So now you just want to melt this peanut butter. I did like half a pot because of fat. Nutella's not on the recipe, but if you want to dump in a little bit of Nutella in there, you go ahead and do that, honey. Because ain't nobody going to judge you, okay? Ain't nobody going to judge you in your own home. Don't take it outside, though, you know? Don't tell people what you've been doing. Nobody needs to know that you added a scoop of Nutella. Just do it. Don't tell. Let's see if we can get you a little closer, honeys. Okay, you, you just stay there on my 
carton of soy milk. So you're gonna make sure that's all nice and deadly. There's nuts in here, which is kind of weird. I can't figure out what the nuts are from. <laughs> yeah, this has got fucking nuts in it. Don't use nuts. That's freaking good. That is so good. Woo! That you Okay, so that's all done and melted and lovely. Right, so we've got our goodie. You're just gonna want to pour it all over. Yeah. Oh, that smells so good. This has nuts in it, which is not ideal, but we're gonna ignore that little error we made. Maybe one chocolate would have been enough. Olivera, <laughs> stupid, stupid me. Hey guys, I made way too much chocolate. What have we learned? Use measurements, kids. It's okay, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna pour this into a, another bowl. That will sort everything out. That's really good though, but it's definitely not puppy chow. Not my proudest moment. I just made too much. One bar would have been completely enough. I just had a bit of a panic mode and I was like, I don't think that's enough. So one bar of chocolate, my friends, more than enough. Look at how much extra chocolate. I'm gonna leave that down here and I'm gonna puppy chow this up. So the last step of this process is powdered sugar. Push in to open it, which I cannot do. How the fuck? There we go. Grab your puppy chow out and you're gonna wanna just cover the fuck out of it. I'm dripping chocolate all over the damn lens. And this lighting's kind of moody. So you're gonna want a lot of this shit. Okay. I just, yeah. I don't think this is going very well. Oh, you're supposed to put it in bags, aren't you? Oh, we got sandwich bags. Oh, and pray to God that your mother has some. And you won't find any, but you'll keep looking and you'll realize that there really, really, really aren't any. You're gonna keep looking and then you're gonna ask your mother anyway, even though you already know that there probably aren't any. So my mother was right. I mean, her drawers were right. So I'm probably gonna end up using the whole of this. I need to tell you, something's gone, something's not right here. This is a complete failure. And it's really depressing. I'm starting to feel that there's a reason why you're supposed to use like check cereal and not just any random cereal. Like it's not really working. I mean, like, it's not bad, but it's not what it's supposed to be. No. Well, guys, it's definitely not what it's supposed to look like. It also tastes okay, it's really bad. Really bad. That's all right. I tried. When I get back to wherever the hell I am, where they have Czech cereal, I'm gonna try it for real. Properly following the instructions and ingredients. Ingredients. But for now, first go, I don't think it was too bad. It tastes like ass, but that's all right. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Cheers. Subscribe if you enjoyed, because you should. I make videos all the time, and they're so great. No, I'm kidding. They're not that good, but no, I mean, you should be positive. Let's be positive. They're great. You're great. I'm great. We're all great. Cheers to you, and goodbye. Until next time, bye. There's someone in there. Oh, no, seriously, I don't want to stop.